What are the raw materials for making battery, extant power? Batteries play an important role in our daily lives. They are essential for powering our phones, laptops, and even our cars. But have you ever wondered what goes into making a battery? In this blog article, we'll explore the different raw materials used to make batteries and how they are manufactured. Introduction Batteries are a type of electrical storage device that converts chemical energy into electrical energy. They are made up of several different components and each type of battery has its own unique set of raw materials. Every battery needs a cathode, an anode, an electrolyte, and a container. Depending on the type of battery, different raw materials are used in the manufacturing process. Types of batteries the different types of batteries include lead acid batteries, nickel cadmium batteries, lithium ion batteries, nickel metal hydride batteries, and alkaline batteries. Each type of battery has its own unique set of raw materials and manufacturing process. Lead acid batteries are the most common type of battery and are widely used in automotive applications. Nickel cadmium batteries are rechargeable and are used in many consumer electronics. They are made up of nickel, cadmium, and a container. Lithium ion batteries are rechargeable and are most commonly used in cell phones and laptops. Nickel metal hydride batteries are also rechargeable and are used in many portable electronic devices. They are made up of nickel, metal hydride, and a container. Alkaline batteries are non-rechargeable and are used in many household items. They are made up of zinc, manganese dioxide, and a container. Raw materials used to make batteries. Now that we've looked at the different types of batteries, let's take a closer look at the raw materials used in their manufacturing process. Section 3.1. Lead. Lead is the primary raw material used in the production of lead acid batteries. It is a soft, malleable metal that is highly corrosion resistant. Lead is incredibly versatile and is used in a variety of applications such as automotive batteries, electrical wiring, and even ammunition. Lead is also used in the manufacture of other types of batteries, such as nickel cadmium batteries and alkaline batteries. Section 3.2. Lead Oxide. Lead oxide is another raw material used in the production of lead acid batteries. It is a compound of lead and oxygen and is used in the manufacture of the anode and lead acid batteries. Lead oxide is essential for the production of lead acid batteries as it helps to increase their capacity and efficiency. Lead oxide is also used in the production of other types of batteries, such as nickel cadmium and alkaline batteries. Section 3.3. Sulfuric Acid. Sulfuric acid is an essential raw material for the production of lead acid batteries. It is used in the manufacturing process to form the electrolyte, which is a solution that helps to conduct electrical energy. Sulfuric acid is highly corrosive and is an important component in the production of lead acid batteries. Section 3.4. Copper. Copper is another raw material used in the production of various types of batteries. It is used in the manufacture of nickel cadmium batteries and lithium ion batteries to form the anode. Copper is a highly conductive material and is essential for the production of these types of batteries. Section 3.5. Nickel. Nickel is an important raw material used in the production of nickel cadmium and nickel metal hydride batteries. It is used to form the cathode in these batteries and is essential for their production. Nickel is a highly conductive material and is used in the manufacture of many consumer electronics. Section 3.6. Manganese. Manganese is an essential raw material used in the production of alkaline batteries. It is used to form the anode in these batteries and is essential for their production. Manganese is a highly conductive material and is used in the manufacture of many household items. Section 3.7. Lithium. Lithium is a key raw material used in the production of lithium ion batteries. It is used to form the anode in these batteries and is essential for their production. Lithium is a highly reactive material and is used in the manufacture of many consumer electronics. Section 3.8. Zinc. Zinc is an important raw material used in the production of alkaline batteries. It is used to form the cathode in these batteries and is essential for their production. Zinc is a highly conductive material and is used in the manufacture of many household items. How batteries are manufactured. First, the raw materials are combined in a mixing tank to form the electrolyte. The electrolyte is then added to the cathode and anode, which are then placed in a battery container. The container is then filled with the electrolyte and sealed. The battery is then discharged and tested to ensure it meets the required standards. Once the battery has been tested and approved, it is ready to be used. Conclusion Batteries are an essential component of modern life and they are made up of several different components. Each type of battery has its own unique set of raw materials and manufacturing process. 
We looked at lead, lead oxide, sulfuric acid, copper, nickel, manganese, lithium, and zinc, all of which are essential raw materials in the production of various types of batteries. We also explored the general manufacturing process of batteries and how they are tested and approved before they can be used. If you're interested in learning more about batteries and the raw materials used in their production, check out our other blog videos. Visit our website, www.extantpower.com.